Canada's skilled immigrant draws, will start next year. Today, in this video, we are going to share with you the latest updates on the targeted draws for skilled immigrants, which are starting next year. The federal immigration minister stated that, the targeted draws for skilled immigrants will start for the first time next year. Through these targeted draws, Canada will cherry-pick applicants with the most demanded skills, for the country's regions that need workers the most. Sean Fraser said that, recruiting more doctors and nurses will be a key focus, but only for provinces that make it convenient for health workers, to verify their foreign credentials and start practicing when they arrive. Fraser said that a targeted draw can be done, starting in 2023. This will make it easy to choose workers by the sector they work in and the region in Canada they are going to. Fraser added that this would allow them to bring more healthcare workers to Canada and in regions that would enable them to work. Many profitable immigrant candidates in Canada are ranked on the basis of education, language, and other skills. Those candidates with the highest overall score get an invitation to apply for permanent residence status. Through this change, Canada can choose workers with the skills and sectors it needs, and for people moving to particular regions. There is currently a shortage of workers in Canada, and it's struggling to fill the labour gaps. The latest job vacancy data reveals that 958,500 roles were open in August and 1.0 million unemployed people. The government of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau is uplifting its goals for immigration this week and said it aimed to welcome 1.45 million new permanent residents over the next three years. The federal high-skilled category will hold the targeted draws accounting for nearly 21.1% of newcomers over that period. Different business groups have suggested the government work more on immigration and assist companies in filling their labor gaps. The healthcare system in Canada is suffering from the effects of the pandemic and the shortage of nurses. However, Canada has also made efforts to approve healthcare workers after their arrival, which means that many doctors and nurses who trained abroad did not get to work in their field. In Canada, healthcare is the responsibility of provinces. Sean Fraser said that he is not interested in doing a targeted draw if the healthcare workers come to Canada and are not allowed to practice their job. Fraser said the government would focus on welcoming more skilled construction workers to help build a new housing supply and on selecting newcomers for areas with the absorptive capacity to take them. He further said that the federal government would work with provinces to construct a clear route and proceed with targeted draws for provinces that make the transition easy. As the immigration levels uplift, questions are also being raised about where the newcomers are going to live. There's already a housing shortage in Canada. Minister Fraser mentioned that the government would concentrate on receiving more skilled workers in construction to assist in building more houses and on selecting newcomers for the appropriate areas to take them. Our video update for today ends here. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more updates on Canadian immigration.